Hey everybody, this is Glattercat, and it's time to play. We're back in Captain of Industry. Between episodes, I did a fair amount of terraforming, mostly just let things run, and have been working on replacing my fleet of excavators and trucks with the new upgraded ones. You can see we have a whole assortment of upgraded equipment here. There's still a few little guys floating around. These are the small ones. But that's underway, and I figured I would record another episode. And there's another truck right out of the plant there, out of the factory. <laughs> well, that's good to see. But we've got some problems to take care of. And we have some opportunities, too, things we can build that we couldn't do the last episode. One of the big problems, though, is our fuel production. As we're doing more and more trucking, and as I've got the trucks traveling further and further distances to do to drop off fill and things... Our fuel supply has started to drop, so we need to get after that. Water looks pretty good. Yeah, water's okay. I turned off our two little wells, groundwater wells here. Um, food is incredible. We're, we have a ton of food. We've been blasting through the tech tree like, like crazy between episodes. So there's a bunch of stuff researched, a bunch of new things we can build. We just need land to do it. Um, so let's get back to it. It looks like um, our copper mining is just about full. Their little hoppers here are full. So let's put these guys onto terraforming somewhere, maybe over here. Yeah, let's do let's do that. I'm gonna change their area to be over here, and then I think this is mining designations, if I'm not mistaken. We'll see if they go. And then let me clear some of the designations that are already done. That looks like all of this is done. All of this is done, been filled in with dirt, which is nice. And then these guys have some fill areas here. Let's add some more. Whoops, I don't want that. Minus one. Let's clear all this out. Clear all this out. And let's make this plus one. Okay, I don't know why I did that. Just want plus one. So they can fill in this area with some of the stuff that they chew away over here. We have two of the older excavators here. Maybe I can queue up a new one. Let's unpause this and see if we can't get those replaced with the better excavators. It'll take a bit. Uh, one, two. Because we've got to bring vehicle parts over here and then we unpause it. We have plenty of workers. Oh, we're down to 12, actually. I thought we had more than that. All right, so those guys can do terraforming for a while. Iron's not doing great. That's another problem. Let's get some more excavators put on that. I'm going to take some off of terraforming. That's this guy. Look at all the equipment I have doing the terraforming over in this area. <laughs> They've cleared out a ton of space. But let's take um let's take a couple of the big guys off of here. Maybe a big guy and a small one. And let's put them on iron so we can get that back to where it needs to be. Where's my tower for these guys? That's not you here, I think. Yep. One more of those, one more of those, and then how about one big truck to help? Hopefully we can get iron back up and running. Um, yeah, we burned through a bunch of vehicle parts. I turned on the uh, concrete block production or concrete slab production. Uh, that was basically turned off. Now we have a little bit of bricks, a little bit of that. All of our construction parts, I think we're probably fully stocked up with our storage. Looks like maybe there's room for more construction part threes. I'm not sure. Um, the other thing I did between episodes is I learned that these water towers can only handle 24 per minute. And each one of these kicks out 24 per minute. So I had it going into one and I noticed that our little smokestack was firing off, getting rid of the steam. So that caused me to check and see what the problem was. So I added another cooling tower same basic routing. We're routing the water that comes out of that back to this main, semi-main trunk that goes and feeds our boilers. 
Uh, we'll keep an eye on that. We need to do that down here. We now have land where we can do it. But let's get on the oil. That's my biggest concern. We may even have to pause to do this. Uh, let's take care of this warning first. Central terraforming, no available place to dump products. It might be the dirt. What do you have? Rock. Should be places to dump the rock. I think the issue might be this thing might be filling up. And so the trucks feel like they don't have a place to drop off. I'm going to upgrade this, actually. I just extended our little chain of getting rid of rock. We probably need to add something like that for dirt. I'm down here. I started filling in dirt. I'm just going to cover this sand if I need to. And then we'll leave some patches open to do mining. But you can see this is all new land that we've kind of reclaimed. And these guys are just chewing, chewing away. Coal looks pretty good. Here's coal for this backup power generation or original power generation. More coal here. So coal's looking fine. We haven't, I haven't even replaced the excavators there yet. Okay, now, finally, let's get uh, looking at this oil. Um, I did increase the number of workers. Oh, man, let's see. We have to, we do have to solve this problem first. Sorry. No place to dump products. There's dumping here. I wonder if that, there it goes. It just went away. Yeah, I think it's this hopper's filling up too fast. This is an upgraded belt. And it wasn't filling up too fast before. I guess I can do... That's not going to help anything, right? It's not really going to help the throughput if I just let them dump in there too. So we'll see. Hopefully this will keep up. We'll have to keep an eye on it. We also have a new fill area over here that hopefully they can decide to take things to. So we'll get this all filled in to one high. Still getting that same complaint. What could we do? I can't upgrade this again to a big monster. That seems like overkill. I guess let's just play it by ear and see what happens. That is a problem. This guy, where are you? Why are you bringing... Oh, he's going to go refuel. Yeah, we have an issue here, right? These trucks from far away should not be bringing material into this storage. I hope they're not taking truck export off. Truck export off. Truck export off. Here, these guys should have build designations nearby. Like this truck, where did that come from? Come all this way to dump in there. He has rock that this guy, I see, it could be, let's see where you belong. No, he's going to service these guys. Oh, maybe, he, I have no idea, unless he went to go refuel. But I definitely don't want to see big trucks. Here's another one. Who do you belong to? You belong to the terraforming crew. Why are you bringing rock over there? I think imports need to be kept on. Export routes. Configures dedicated export routes. Once the storage is set, we export to another storage. Trucks will only export products to that storage. Why are these guys doing this circular thing? Oh, I seem to remember this from a previous season, having this issue. Like this guy right here, he, well, he's going to go dump. That is upgraded conveyor. This guy. Where did you come from? Why am I not seeing where these guys are coming from? Let's keep an eye on these two trucks. See if they give up, if they dump a little and then give up or something. He dumped. These guys think they don't have a place to dump. 
No, cannot deliver rock. No valid designations. There's tons of designation right there. Other trucks are doing it. Wonder if we're getting glitchy or if I have something set up here wrong. It configures dedicated export routes for trucks. If you'd like to deliver materials mined here to a specific storage, but nowhere else, you can assign this mine control tower to the chosen storage. You can also assign it to another mine control tower in order to use that one for dumping. Okay, that's our problem. Let's disconnect this, these guys. Boom, boom, boom. Now they can go wherever they want. Let's see what happens there. If that stops our problem. So maybe the trucks were only being allowed to dump into the storage and not dump over here, but this had dumps. I'm not sure what the story is. Here comes another truck. <clears throat> we need to solve this before the oil. This is uh, just wasting fuel. Let's do accept assigned only here. So that only the tr look at that. Why? Why are you doing that? Hmm. <clears throat> Gotta think that one through. There is a way to prevent this. Export routes. Once the storage is set to export onto another storage, trucks will only export to that storage. Yeah, I don't know what the problem is, why they're doing that. But it's a problem. This one's doing the same thing, taking it back to the beginning. Hmm. Guy's gonna dump. He's assigned to this hopper. This guy's assigned to the hopper. He's gonna dump now this time. But he didn't last time. This one took it all the way back over. These are the only two trucks that should be pulling material from here. And so I think we have to map this guy back to import. Once the storage is set to input from another storage, trucks will only import products from that storage. No other unassigned storage or machine will be able to import. Okay, let's do that. Import route back down to this guy. I think that's the terraformers. So in theory, the only trucks now that can do this, that can put material here, are the ones that are assigned to that mine controller tower, not the ones that were assigned to this. I think that may have solved our problem there. Don't think we're going to... I think that may have solved it. Shouldn't see trucks going back the other direction. Just keep an eye on this for a second. Make sure we don't see any loaded trucks of rock going back to the start of this chain. I have a feeling we're good. All right, finally, over here, before this gets too low. All right, we want to scale this up kind of big. We know we can do, what, two more modules on this thing? So let's see if we can put those in. Uh, can I copy paste or something? Oh, that's settings.
Let's see if I can find our modules. Fluid module, medium. Yeah, that's the biggest I have. Fluid module, medium, boom. Okay. Let's upgrade these guys, boom. We have a lot of construction parts. I believe to do that. And then I guess we should go with mega storage, right? Two mega liquid storages off of this. Liquid storage three. How's that gonna line up? Does it line up nice? Look at that. Boom. Now looks to be an ideal time to get rid of these. Let's do it. This one has a little bit of oil. It will drain out. I hate to say it. We probably want to get rid of these containers, these storages too, and upgrade them. We have a little room. We might be able to pull that off by doing it over here. Oh, let's see how this is all piped. It's not the best. I'm there, huh? Um, so it will be this way. Coming in from the top here as we look. In from the top. Then it would be out through the top and then in through the top if we wanted it. Here, let's do that. This will be our diesel storage. Boom. And what I want to do, let's get this quick built. We're going to burn through a fair amount of these uh, construction part threes. That'll keep our production going. Maintenance is still holding up, even despite us having more trucks and more fuel being burned or they're traveling more, which would seem to mean that they're going to be, you know, requiring more maintenance. All of this pipes can go, all of these. Let's get these out of here. Boom. And boom. Trucking is all of a sudden very busy. Uh, between episodes, pretty much the whole time, trucking has been pretty stable. We can let the new trucks um, just join the general fleet for now. See, where's our vehicle depot? Over here. Let's make sure we have more queued up. We do. We're good. Um, vehicle part two production is over here. Our unity is already in the negative. We have health issues all of a sudden. Minus two. <laughs> Minus two health. Always something. Always something. Okay, no product assigned to cargo module two. Okay, I guess we got a set. Good oil. That makes sense. Good oil. We're actually short workers. Let's make sure I took that edict off. We can let people start. Reproducing again. Population edict. Growth pause. We'll turn that off. We'll start getting people again. You guys probably take more workers. Four for the new ones. Three for the old ones. Okay, this fuel. I want to drain out somehow. How can we do this safely? Maybe we can redirect all the new fuel temporarily into here. And then let this drain out so we can get rid of these. Let's try that. I'm going to grab a knee pipe. Oh, man, I have trucking going through here, though. Uh, we'll get it figured out. Bit of a project, but we'll get it done. Uh, up. You, it's fine. However, you can sneak over here. It's fine by me. 
This is going to be somewhat temporary. Just want to get all new fuel going into um, our new tank. Set the product on this guy. Diesel. And I actually want to shut this pipe off. So let's pause that one for now. Uh, we, th I think, let's quick remove that. Keep an eye on Unity. We're not accumulating it all of a sudden. Okay, there's another crude oil storage. Short on people. I'm going to take down just temporarily one of our rubber productions. Just to free up some workers. Could easily take down farms. Let's take down one of the farms as well. And one of the reasons I have all this food storage is so we can do that pretty easily and free up workers when we need them in a pinch. Okay, now this crude oil needs to find its way, I think, in this pipe right here. This guy, I believe, is our oil pipe. Oh, man. Yeah, I think so. So oil needs to find its way there. That's probably enough storage, right? I mean, if we wanted to, we could feed into another big guy right here. These guys are empty. Let's get those, except for that one. Let's get rid of these. Got some more pipe work here that can go. This is a bit overdue, this project. Yeah, just thinking, do we want to store more crude oil? These guys hold... 40 each. That's quite a lot. Plus another 4,000 or something. 4,300 just about. That's probably good enough. So I guess this can all just connect into a massive pipe. In fact, we might have three third level pipes now. No, pipe twos. I have pipe threes being researched. All uh, right. I have no idea what he just delivered, but. Just thinking about a route here, how we want to do it. What about you, you, and then let's come up. And basically, I want to do that. So let's put you uh, right there. Get rid of this little angled section. Quick remove that. That on a quick build. This guy is complaining he can't get somewhere he needs to go. Where do you want to go? Uh, you can get there. I did not block your way. Did I block your way with pillars? Looks like I did, right? We added another pillar here, probably. Oh man, the pillar problem. Let's see if we can. Figure out a way to not have a pillar. Maybe chew this pipe back a bit. Yeah, the pillars are a bit annoying. I wish they just didn't have a hitbox or something. But it's all part of the game, I suppose. That looks improved, right? Trucks are moving through. This guy, you should be able to get through there. Can I pause you and see if you will rethink your routing? Unpause. Still doesn't want to. Uh, let's just recover. 
send him somewhere. He'll get back into the fleet. Oh, is this guy getting imports or something of fuel? Off. Off imports on exports. Fine. I'm going to drain that so we can delete it. Almost done, except uh, I disconnected it. Can I delete it? This has imports on. Do this empty this guy. And I think if I mark it for delete, it may cause it to empty as well. I, you know, truck will come by and empty that. Hopefully put it in here. We're doing workers 13. Fuel's going down as we do this. So it's a little, a little dubious. Looks like our refiners are starting to do their thing though. We have fuel coming through this way. And then these guys are draining out, slowly going to drain out. Okay, there's our second big storage. Okay, we should have crude. Oh, we put these modules in last. Or most recently, so the ship does not is not full with oil on that side. I think if I quick deliver this, we'll see the oil start flowing. There we go. Not bad. That's set to oil. That's set to oil. Our ship can now do has much higher capacity. The oil rig does not have much on it right now. We could ramp that up too. Why don't we just for safety, let's go to this oil rig, kick this up to max speed. Plenty of reserves, I think. Love to get to doing biofuel. Um, and it looks like we could upgrade this thing too. At some point, maybe we will. Right now I'm actually short on construction part threes from doing this building. This still has seven. I have it set to empty. Truck export on. Um, here comes a truck. This guy may take the rest of that oil. All right, good. Done. Starting to get some new fuel here. These guys should be, this should be flowing out of here, right? Oh, it's going that way. Ew. I see. I see. I see. All right. Let's clear this out. The fuel comes in here and then works its way around here. This is the end of the line for the fuel. So we can start deleting these off too. And now I've got warnings to deal with. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom. All right, unity is not too bad. Workers are down. Let's uh, shut down another farm. We have tons of food. Like I said, that's the reason why I have so much food, or one of the main reasons. Okay, we got pickups that can't get where they want to go. Let's see what they're pouting about. Okay, and these must not, these must have like import and export turned on or something. Yeah, let's take care of that. I dropper you and then Okay. Off off. Off off. And we should be good now. Where do you need to go? You can't get to. Um Yeah, it's deconstructed, buddy. And it's set to off. Let's reset these guys or pause them and see if they reset. There he goes.
Hold it for a second. And he's still unhappy. Where? Why do you want to go there? Wants to go to something that's being deconstructed. I guess we'll just quick remove that one. See if that changes his mind. Looks like it did. Okay, we lost potatoes due to lack of workers. Big deal. Another pick. Is this the same one? What am I missing? Where do you want to go? You really want to go to these places you can't. Yeah, I'm not sure what that's all about. Seems awfully strange. This truck export is not even set on those. Alright, this diesel is going to drain out. Hopefully this is going to fill up faster than these drain out. And then we'll need to route the output of this fuel to match where this fuel is currently going. We can connect some of that up now um, and just pause the pipes, right? So we have diesel that's got to come out through here. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I think, yeah, we're going to have to do that now. I was going to say, we're going to have another big storage here for fuel. Boom. We'll have three of them. And we could use one of the output ports to connect up to this pipe here. But that's going to be a while. And this is fueling our cargo ship and fueling our excavators, actually, indirectly. So let's run some pipe. See how we can do this best way. This is just going off to the shipyard. Is that really it for that fuel? I think that's it. Eventually, we may want to fork off of this fuel line, run it over here, run it up, and get another um, refueling station or something a little closer by. I guess we have this one over here, though. That's not bad. Yeah, that's pretty good. We need one way at the other side of the island. Can I get a pipe through here? Let's do it. Let's get this pipe routed. We need one that's going to hook up. Back this way. Um, where to, how about, can you go up one, what, like that, and eventually this will connect into this pipe, it'll be the new output pipe, once this is all drained. In fact, can I get closer? You stay up high. Uh, unsnap. Looks like I can't. Why not? I'm on this track. Nice and high, nice and high, high, high. That. And this pipe will go. This pipe will take over. But we want to pause it. When it built, so I'm going to quick deliver it. And I'm going to pause it. This little nugget need to be quick deliver. I'm going to pause this guy. Boom. And then we'll unpause it once all this is drained out. Yeah, it's taking a while for the oil rig to catch up. Hopefully we'll be all right on fuel. All right, we've got a bunch of warnings here. Let's see what we can do about it. Terraforming, terraforming. Look at all these trucks waiting to dump rock. 
Oh, we have the same problem. Here's another truck dropping that rock off in the wrong spot. Man, that's weird. It's a bunch of fill designations all over the place. This is all fill designation. New reason they can't dump rock there. I think we need a bigger thing. Let's do it. Let's go. Oh, I hate to do it like this. Because it's still going to back up. I could run double belts. Would that be better? Instead of just a bigger storage. I don't think the belt is backing up. Oh, I take it back. It is. Let's get another truck on here. What are we doing on truck production? 106. There's an excavator. We have three trucks queued up. Um, let's get another truck onto this storage. And I want it to be a big one. So I'm going to prune this back by two. Going to kick up this by two. That thing always stays empty. I can upgrade this to buy us more time. Cycling increase, dismiss. We still have research going on, so that's all good. Yeah, we don't want this belt backed up. I think these trucks might be coming now. They're just coming from over here. They don't have a place to dump for some reason because they're only allowed to dump into this storage by how we set things up. And that was to try and prevent other trucks from dumping in here. But that's where they're coming. That's why they're coming from far away. Um, what we could do, let's add some trucks here. Let's add a truck to, let's add a truck to this guy. Uh, it kind of defeats the purpose, right? But maybe that one could go feed this area or something? Hmm. Yeah, this thing filling up was a problem. Let's see. We'll see. We'll keep an eye on that one. Okay, small excavator has no reachable terrain designations. Uh, this is... Wow, terraforming. Let's get that moved. That is this guy, the desert, the um area. Wow. Wow. We made some progress. Oh my goodness. If we take this down, we're going to get a bunch of limestone that we don't really want. Um, but we could get closer. Let's see the overlay. Mm, are we going to tap into limestone? I don't want to. We're going to tap into limestone no matter what we do, it looks like. Uh, we're actually getting closer to the copper area. All right, let's hit the area. Let's keep heading this way. Clear all these mining designations. They're all done. Just the mining ones. And then we're going to set down some new mining designations. Level one. I don't want to get into the sand, but I want to get near it. <laughs> kind of thing. And let's set these guys free here to get on it. I'll have to figure out something to do with the limestone as they start taking that up. I 
think this will keep them busy for a minute or two. There they go. <laughs> Look at all those guys. That's awesome. I like it. I like it. We're making progress finally on reclaiming some of this land. Let's go back to the oil rigs, see how we're doing. Okay, our ship's coming in. This should have a lot of oil on it. Not bad. Almost 2,000 uh, units. Not quite. Uh, what would that be? 1,700 units, something like that. Trucks may not be able to get to this to destroy it. Let's just quick remove it. Unity is slowly declining, but not bad. Uh, looks like our health bounced back for some reason. Not sure how that dynamic really works, to tell you the truth. It seems to bounce around. Trucking is stable. Food, I'm sure, is more than fine. We'll get those farms um, fired up again. We're likely going to have to increase our refining. We'll see how we do. Um, I could actually put in another big storage. That's going to have to be rapidly built as well. I don't think trucks can actually make their way in here. They got some of this old pipe. Yeah, this pipe right here is the problem, right? Not sure if we should bother with that or not. Try and bring that pipe up high. We could. Could have it come over one more. Hmm. Travel under here, but needs to eventually get into this. Oh, and it's got a fork. No, it doesn't. It's down low. Could we make that better? I think we can. Let's do it. Let's do it. I think this pipe can come out. We can weave that one a little better than we have it. Quick remove just for speed. Pipe two. I do have pipe threes, level threes queued up for research. I don't want to come through. Sorry, let me try and get a decent camera angle. Up under here. Not that high. Right there. Can we do this without putting a bunch of pillars in? Um, can it go up higher or is that as high as it'll go? As high as it'll go unless I move over, which I kind of don't want to. How about right there? Already a pillar. And then once I get this far out, pillars almost don't matter. And now you just need to find your way to that. And we'll quick build that guy. That is our fuel supply line. That's kind of important to keep that thing open. We don't want the refiners backed up right now. It's got a bunch of crude to process, a bunch of room to store it. And we're still draining our pre-existing supply. This is not climbing very fast, though. Little concerned. Tons of storage now for crude, way more than we had before. And it's cleaner and upgraded. Oh, excavator has no terrain. Oh, these guys now, huh? Okay, you will. 
just, you can't see it yet, right? Or you can't get to where you want to mine. Uh, level one. Mining. What about... Now can you reach this? Oh, this is all level two. Okay. I see we have some stuff here that's not quite the way I want it. Let me pull this all back. Okay, mining designations should all be level one. Go. Down. I want you guys to just chew away while you're terraforming. Like this is just like the other terraforming area. We're just gonna terraform this thing like crazy. Uh, I'm not sure why I did that. Okay. This can go. Down to level one, this whole area. That looks good. Do we have an excavator here? We do. Let's send one of our little guys. This guy, let's scrap him. Three big unassigned ones. How is that possible? I specifically need this one to be <laughs> assigned. How can I make sure this is the one that gets assigned? Because the other ones won't be able to make it here. Um, how can we do that? Hmm. I'm trucks. Well, I'll try it. I'm just going to add an excavator. Hopefully, that's the one that goes. Oh, they're both sitting right here. Nice. Okay, fine, 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 fine. Uh, that goes there. And let's scrap the other tiny one we have. We'll wait for him to unload. Boy, as soon as you click on it, you get all the mining designations. As soon as he unloads, we need to get big trucks over here too. Speaking of which, do we have any extras we could just assign from far away? We have one. Get that guy assigned, and then let's scrap that little pickup. Oh, we've got a bigger truck on its way. Here come two huge excavators. This is where we're pumping out new trucks. 107 out of 110 available vehicles. Let's scrap another little guy. Just to make room for the vehicle count so we can keep producing bigger ones. Uh, same thing here. We've got an excavator we can assign. Let's pull off a little guy if we can find one. There's one. Wait for this guy to empty out. Speed up time. And Scrap you. Get this other big excavator assigned here. That's that guy. Should be. There goes our pickup trucks to be scrapped. You guys did a good job. Appreciate it. Uh, we can free up workers here. We're done building excavators. Okay, we have 27 workers. Let's turn on the farm. In fact, we can turn on both farms. We previously shut down. Unity again is still slowly declining. Okay, fuel's being refined. Is this another one we can take out? All right, let's do a little more routing of fuel. We need fuel to go to 
the shipyard, which we haven't taken the ship out in ages. I've been waiting for upgrades on that. Um, so this one, maybe just a regular pipe. You can get close, right? And then this little pipe we can just take out right now. The other, the old one. I think we need it. Slowly moving away from the old storage to the new. Uh, how's our ship doing? 1,453. And again, this is like, what? 1,600? 1,760 or something like that. So it's close to going to get oil. All right, warnings. Not enough maintenance. Ooh, man, I told you. We're getting close. This may be the land for maintenance. Um, our existing maintenance setup is here. So we might be able to do something on this new plot of land that we've created that's much more scalable. In fact, we could also move this mine control tower. This is our limestone mine control tower. Maybe we should move this up. Just checking out these. Yeah, we could get this off the lower level and start filling in dirt a little bit through here. But they're going a long ways to fill. I wish they would fill this. Let's um redo these designations. Because I, I redid these before, and then all of a sudden they started delivering to them again. Uh, these seem like they're closer than that. Maybe not. Um, I can turn truck export on here, maybe. All right, fill designations. Level one. Fill it in, guys. Fill this stuff in. Don't want to have to worry about water later on. I just want to be able to dig later without worrying about water. My people dying and they're drowning in their excavators when they mine this stuff out. Hopefully that'll become attractive for somebody to start dumping. Um, in fact, we could do that, right? Truck export is on and we have empty. So maybe that keeps this up a priority. Let's do the same thing here. Truck export on empty. Maybe that'll help our throughput a little tiny bit. Okay, we got a bunch of trucks queued up. That's all good. Maintenance is in trouble significantly. We have a bit of a worker shortage again. Hope I don't have crew sitting on here. I don't. That's good. Take down a farm again. And then let's see. Yeah, let's move this mind control tower. Let's, let's add a new one. Where can you go? This is for limestone. Could quick build it up here, but then the vehicles will complain that they can't get to it. All right here. We're not going to do sand mining anytime soon. Let that build. Let's clear these mining, does these fill designations. It's all filled in. That's awesome. So we'll let this stay the sand mine area and we'll just maybe fill in kind of around it with dirt. Let's get this quick built. Uh, I hate to use the unity, but it's 0.9. This is going to become the new um, limestone area. In fact, it's already got a decent sized. Yeah, it's actually, it's area is actually in the right spot, but I'll make it a little bigger. Boom.
something like that. And this guy, you go and you go. Add this guy back. Add a couple of these guys back. We're not using a lot of limestone right now. No one's assigned. So now let's get rid of that. That goes. Then we'll fill in that area with dirt. We'll fill in all this area with dirt. And then probably next episode. Oh man, look at that maintenance. Oh man. Oh man. Could be iron. Is that our problem? It is. Iron's our problem. All right, we have a fill situation. Looks like these guys are playing in the dirt or something. They're dumping and then they're taking. That's a problem. Let's clear out some of this stuff. Our problem is iron, not really maintenance. So let's go get some mining designations over here quickly. We have three large trucks. I don't want you guys to spend any time over here, so go away. Get to the iron. And then maybe I can put um, a big vehicle on the iron. We have, we do. Let's get another big vehicle on there. We have two big excavators and one little guy. I don't have another big excavator yet to put on it. I don't think. It doesn't look like it. No. I think that's going to catch up. I think that's going to solve our maintenance problem. Oh, not enough workers again. Are we losing people? What could that be? Factories spinning up that were down or something? I'm not sure why. I'm tempted to take down research. What could we shut down? We're not going to shut down diesel production. I think what I can shut down... We have tons of concrete slabs. I have both these guys running. Let's turn you off. And let's turn you off. Boom. We have a bunch stored up. I should turn this guy off too. It's only two workers, but I might forget to put that back on. Tons of concrete slabs, so pr that production will still go. And we have a ton of bricks on the belt too, so that production can keep going. I could turn this guy off. I'll just leave him on. Okay, we have the workers we need. Excavator's complaining. It can't get to where it wants to. Hmm, why not? It's hard for me to see the terrain. Let's make sure we have a dump designation where we think we do. This needs to have a dump designation to plus two. In fact, we could, let's trim this back a little bit. Then put in a fill designation. Level two here. Hopefully that's not going to be, probably that's going to be great dirt. You know, the stuff that grass will grow on. Here comes load right now. I'm confused as to why it's not going after these. The excavator should be able to get to it. Why aren't you guys trying to go to these open areas? There he goes. We have two online. Let's see if we can get the third one online here soon. There he goes. Okay, good. Got to keep an eye on copper. How are we doing in our copper hoppers? Those look good. Tell you what, let's end this episode here and we will get back to it.
Still need to finish up our fuel overhaul here, at least our storage of crude and storage of diesel. Uh, not too much more to do. Looks like this guy can go. But yeah, we'll get to that next episode. For now, Splattercat saying thanks so much for watching. Definitely give these videos a thumbs up if you want to see this series continue. Um, that will let me know to keep going or to cut it short. And I'll see you all in the next episode.